So what is up bosses, it's your boy Boss Fabwad, and welcome to a game called It Still. So a lot of people are considering this to be the scariest game in the most recent years. And I don't blame them because the first time I saw this, the game I got reminded of the most was mainly maybe because of the graphical style and just like the stuff that you do, like it's like a kind of maze thing. It did remind me of I'm Scared, which I'm not actually scared, that's not what I'm saying. The game called I'm Scared, which is pretty much like the OG scariest horror game ever made type thing. That was like years ago, like 2011, maybe even 2010, 2012 maybe, like that genre when that game released. So R is to do something. The hell was this? Okay. We enter the freaking Matrix when we press the letter R apparently. I think this is where I started. Yeah, that's probably- I think that is literally where I started. Okay, I think maybe because I turned around on, like, the map screen, it turned me around. That's not an enemy or something, right? That is- does this make that sound? 13. Have I got 13, or is there 13 left? Is this gonna say 12? Okay. So kind of like a dark deception, or I guess Pac-Man type thing. They were just in a maze collecting this stuff. I've seen that there's a few other challenge modes. And this would be, if it is, the scariest game in recent memory. I guess, yeah, the scariest game in recent memory. Probably not years. Because it is a bit hard to say the scariest game in years. Do you remember all of the games that have come out in the past... Or the horror games that have come out in the past few years? I don't. That's just horror games, not all of the games that I've played. Which, obviously, only 50-60% of horror games, okay? Jesus. Calm the freaking hell down, mate. Oh, my volume was only half and that scared the crap out of me. That's great. Great news. Great to know I'm going to have a freaking heart attack today. Let's not be doing that again, please. Oh, I can actually knock on doors. Oh, I can knock everywhere and it makes... Oh, no, what? Oh, yeah, I, I can just knock around doors. I guess, like, the collision is just... Oh, Jesus, hello! I, I guess that lures you, yeah. Lure you over there. That's a cool lure mechanic, I imagine, is what that is. It seems like it's a big one-way area. I guess I can check, yeah. Oh, and I can see... Oh, no, I, I guess I can't see areas of the map that I've explored. I can just see if there's an orb around me, I can see its location. So I know there's three of them. I can see on that map there, yeah. I guess I want to knock and then immediately, like, run away. Quite fast. Behind me? There's no one behind me. Why did I turn around, though? Freaking horror game 101. I like how the barn actually stays on the screen. Okay, I don't know what that was. Something just happened. Flash it. Does that say? I mean, for a first attempt, there's five left. For a first attempt, there's four left. Insane. I can't crouch or anything, so I guess you can't really hide. Oh. Okay, that's bad. I actually kind of heard him on the right then, so I guess that's good me knocking and then running to the left. Okay. I get angry when you run. Do you now? Oh, we actually have a... A main menu. Wonderful. Didn't have a main menu before. I guess I'll do the resolution and everything then, because I went straight into the game last time. You hear slithering down the hallway. Very concerning. So immediately there's two. Oh, there actually are. So you can get four pretty much just instantly. It's just each way you can go. So up, down, left, and right. There's one. So there's one just on the left here, but then I have to just turn around to get the other ones quite quickly. Then I go back, so I take the first right. Or maybe not. Maybe get this one first. That's the first one I got, because I think that's the fan noise that I hear there. I'll have a look where the next one is. Okay, up from here. Up this way from here? Maybe this is the right one? Hello, smiley face. Is that a secret wall? Are there secret walls in this game? Who knows? Is that two there? That's not. Okay, yeah, you're there. I'm gonna have to run for a minute. So you hit me. I don't hear anything. Oh, all I hear is one of the orbs near me. Okay, so if I go up here, it's on the right of me. Oh, hello! Well, it's gonna be random. Oh, E to zoom in. 
random things happening like that, but I guess there's only one enemy that can actually kill me. I mean, already it seems like, or it feels like this is quite a lot faster, like two more and I would have beaten my previous record. If I hear someone, do I knock or do I knock if I don't hear someone? Or is it s simply, as I said before, just something to be able to get away? All right, I really need to check. I don't know where I'm going here. Okay, so yeah, I do continue. I continue to the right here. Okay, brilliant. The one place I can't freaking go? There is this stuff on the ground. I mean, that ends there. So that's clearly not going to be useful. Up this way is another two, I believe. If I can get them two, then a new record. This does look familiar, though. Oh, Jesus Christ, mate. I heard you like a second before you got me. That was a bit of a trek for that one. Oh, come on. What, what do I do at that point, then, if, he, if he's there? What do I do? If he's there like that, how do you... not die? It says I get angry when you run. I, I wasn't running, though. I mean, I started running when he was there. And I guess I'll just continue to not really... <coughs> Excuse me, Jesus. Sorry about that. Because I continue to not really worry about the actual enemy there when that happens. Okay. That time I ran for a split second. All right, I guess I'll just have to... Greater anger monsters who are searching for you, but there are certain times where it is safe or necessary. So I don't know yet. I, maybe that one is just necessary to run then, as it says, like, sometimes it's necessary to run. Yeah, there's one there. Okay. Wait, three stars? They weren't there before, right? Were stars there before? And there was a thing on the bottom right before. Oh no, that appears then. Three stars, but then three of the stars have miniature stars under them. So when you can see four at the same time, that's really good. Okay, wait. You have to look at them. I didn't consider that. I just looked at you and you didn't get me. You just have to look at them. And I guess if looking doesn't work, then for that specific character, you need to run away. Okay, I don't know why I didn't consider that before. Yeah, run here. So this is the guy that maybe gets angry for when you run. And I know that doesn't do anything. I don't know why I'm trying. God, I, I just went into a dead end then. 200? 200? Die? Have I done it? I swear if there was literally like one more left. I mean, it said I got three. And then I think it started doing the name thing. So I think there literally was one more left to get then. So it said three, then it said 200, then it said die. Meaning there was one left, right? Four, and I'll go back because I saw another one. Then the next one should say 200. I just ran into him without realising. Keep thinking that might just eventually do something. I mean, it would have been cool if it was like a, a small... I didn't even hear you that time, mate. Jesus Christ, okay. There is actually one left now. It's saying one, so is that- does that mean that there's no guy here? Oh! Never mind. I'm- I'm stuck on everything. God, there's nowhere to go. I guess because I was just in a complete dead-end area there. Okay, I much prefer this guy being here. Because he can't just insta-kill me. Is it anywhere? It's nowhere near me. Okay. And apparently them guys can use that and break it sometimes. I know just that guy that's killed me before is just going to randomly kill me again and then I'm just going to have to start again. I just still don't get that guy's mechanics. I'm just so drastically moving around. Oh, I did it. I actually did it. Hell yes. This is only the beginning. Okay, I haven't even started the game yet. Proceed to zoom. Please, if I die now... Don't mean that I have to do it again. This is a classic mode that we've just done. There is no way out, I imagine, yeah. Oh, I 
I'm really slow at walking, like literally a third of the speed of walking, but then running, I'm just the same speed. Okay, I will furt her in. I can't go- oh, ho hello, I can't go this way, I guess that's why, because there's going to be someone coming out. I'm about to run, oh, there we go. You've not seen the enemy achievement unlocked, hell yes, one of eleven. Yes, nine percent through the achievements. Oh, I've got one star now, oh, I've just- what have I done? I click the actual star. Oh, what, what am I doing now? Thir 40 to get? I guess that's- I mean, that's kind of nice, because you're, you're going to get them way more regularly. And they still make the sound as well. I feel like this would have been a lot harder if there was 40 to get and they didn't make the sound. Okay, well, I'm keeping my strat of the running. I don't think you're the you're one that can kill me, right? Need to go back around because I saw that one there. Already a quarter of the way through, though. Gotta really listen out for them. If I hear them, I've got to stay relatively in that area. You're again one that I think I'll just ignore, maybe? No, you are actually the one. But then, you're the one before they got me. Let me go into Morris and just... What was I doing? If I just click play, does it send me back to there? No, it sends you back to there. So, so what? I click the actual star, and it sends me here. I don't think this is anything to do with the actual modes. I, I don't, maybe it is shutter mode or whatever just the next mode is. I guess I'm on shutter mode now, and I can go to play. Is it just going to be in the same place then? Yeah, loading shutter mode. You see checkers under your eyelids. Click to flash? Oh god, okay. Is it still... Yeah, still getting these. Yeah, so I, I can click this forever. I'm, I'm just gonna run out now. And die. I just wanna see, yeah, so the batteries... I, for some reason, didn't realise what the batteries meant, but like, obviously it's... How many times I can flash? All right. And I guess the actual star things are different things in itself as well. There's only a very few amount of them, though. A what? Well, that, that was actually a fake wall. There are fake walls. Okay. With that few amount there, there were two right there, then. Okay, so this, this is one that I actually don't want to be running, then. Running, or running, out of batteries. Because I want to be flashing this guy. If I'm running, then it would just be a way bigger chance of me running into him. I freaking flashed you, mate! So I think four's my record on this one. It's cool though, I like when a game like this comes out and it has like, this amount of stuff to it. There's a door there, can I- oh Jesus! Can I still interact with the doors? This area is amazing. I guess this area might just be there all the time. But there's three just here. So there's another one just here as well. Yeah. I much prefer that when he runs away. I guess because I run. And the more you run, the less likely he is to actually run away from one of the flashes. I can see a bit of blue flash here, so... It's gonna be another one here. Probably worth to just no. Was that? I thought that was gonna be like another secret room thing there. Then maybe wait in some of the rooms that is the corners. Yep. In case he's gonna. Oh no, that was just another secret room. I thought that was him there. What? Do you flash him and then immediately just have to run away then? So he doesn't know where you are? Like if you walk away, he's, he's just gonna know where you are then? That's gotta be what you do with him then. I do like how they've really utilized like other renditions of light. And it's obviously like, the probably the main reason is just to look nice. Or the main gameplay reason is so do you think that there's an orb there? I guess because there's only a really small amount left. Okay, so it's like it's like Cartoon Dog then. It reminds me of. It's like he has a hissy fit or like an anger fit, whatever. And then he just starts running at me no matter what. And when he gets stunned, he just stays there. But then now I guess he might be back to 
stunned, I'm going to run away. I don't think you can run into this guy, though. Like, this specific character. I thought I walked into one of the doors, then. Let me flash this, because there's a bit of blood on the wall. Is that going to be... Oh! Jesus. Should I be flashing him instead? I just really hope that I can hear when he's there. Okay, well, I know where I am now, and I've been here, so I need to leave here immediately. Again, I thought that was another freaking one. I don't need to flash them, I need to walk into it, so it's a waste of battery. But that means that this must be, like, the... Another bottom corner of the area. Oh, God, we're back to this, are we? Oh! There is one there, though. Oh, well, I've done it! No, there's one left. I flashed you! I freaking flashed you, mate! I absolutely flashed you. Why did you do that? Come on. So again, as soon as I get 200, it means I've got two left. Oh, we Doing this quite early. Oh, God, no. I really do need to get ones on the way. Oh! Jesus Christ, man. There is one here, I know. I went quite far away because I needed to. Yeah, there is one here. So should only be two left. Oh, I've done it! Oh! No! Oh my god. Oh my god, mate. Jesus Christ. Don't freaking scare me like that. Two modes done. Maybe. There might be another bit on the thing. Why am I... Oh, I'm, uh, I, guess, I guess it's, yeah, the pictures I've uh, taken. Is that actually one of the pictures I took? Is that genuinely, like, one of the pictures I took? You will miss me. I think I will do display capture. You might be able to... There we go. You can see you will miss me there. So that's two of 11 achievements, and you'll see that we have two stars as well. So if I click on the second star, I guess I'll get teleported to a secret thing. Maybe we could do a second video on this. Like, one video going through, like, the normal modes, and then a second video going through, I guess, the five bonus modes. Yeah, because it seems like there's three or five of these. Hide and seek next. Brilliant. Sounds terrifying. And there is actually two big reasons to beat the modes. One, so you get that five-star completion, and two, so after you get the five-star completion, you can then do five more modes, I guess technically, within each star, which I've never seen before, like getting a star, like a getting a star in FNAF, say, and then clicking on that specific star and it teleporting you to a new place. Never seen that before. Right, hide-and-seek means what? I guess I'll just purely focus on the orbs. Because that is the only thing I care about. That's the only thing that will allow me... The, the only thing that's going to allow me to win each mode is collecting all the orbs. I don't need to do anything after the orbs. All I need to do is collect these orbs. So anything else? I'm it. Oh, I'm it. So I'm going to die now. Ready or not, here I come. Oh, brilliant. You hear me? So I'm dead now, yes? I am dead now. You can't run. I am it as in me, my character's it, or as in their it? Oh, F to disable light. Of course, yes, I imagine I just want my light to be disabled all of the time. When hiding, your flashlight will give you away if it is left on crouched pine boxes and shelves. Listen for the stomping. If you stay in place too long, it will find you. When it finds you, it will blast through walls to catch you, make distance. So I might, if I don't, if I'm not going to do the whole hiding thing... I'll just have to not run into it, really. So, go look around. Make sure it's not around. I think that's it over there, because I see a tiny bit of red. So, I can't run through this bit. This is usually the area that it's in. So, I guess as I've got them two now, that's good. Because if it is going to go there now... I don't know what that means. What does that mean? What does that sound mean? I don't know. Can they be behind the box as well, though? I mean, already doing this strategy, I've done way better. Freaking 12 left. Oh, Jesus Christ, man. So they do just know where I am immediately. Or do I now have to hide from them? I guess it is now, yeah. Or w would they get me eventually. 
think it's a good time to test it as I'm still quite early on this mode. Okay, the music's even stopped now. So I might die, but I'm going to go out. I mean, it's still a tester phase. No, he is still looking for me. Yeah, we're dead. So I can't run on that one, but is it possible to beat it without seeing this guy? He's over there now. I've shown the tour gym, but he hasn't seen me, I guess because it's just a bit too far away. This is just back at the beginning now. Yeah, again, like, it seems like every time I hold up that map, I'm just nowhere near another shard. This is my record, right? 12 left, I think. That being a record, though, like, 12 left still. Oh my Jesus Christ! Oh, come on. I am. This one's gonna be a bit more difficult, isn't it? Oh, my! <laughs> Every time, it scares the crap out of me. Jesus Christ. Come on, it's such a good Oh, come on. It was such a good run as well. Such a freaking good run. You... That, there was a wall there, wasn't there? Oh, that's so disappointing. And you could quite possibly win running through all of it if you just get extremely lucky enough to just not run into him. Yeah, there we go. Just ran directly into him. I feel like the torch isn't necessary to turn off unless we're playing hide and seek, right? Because why would it be? Like, you, you can flash him with the torch when he's just, like, his passive self. And that's fine. Yes, yeah, so he's there. As you saw, my torch doesn't affect him at all in that state. It would affect him if he was looking for me and I put my torch on and he'd be like, oh, I found you. But in this initial passive state... Yeah, oh, come on. If I just freaking left him, why was I... Why did I have to be an idiot about it? So now my torch being off is a good idea. Can I do something with this? It would be maybe cool to actually win when he's chasing you, right? I hate it walls, does that say? Playing on a freaking basketball court with these shoes. If I get one more... Four left, though. Look at that. Oh my god, what? Wait, what? Is he back now to be just being somewhere? Oh my god. He's there. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to be so ca careful now. I will know this is fine because this is a long hallway. I like back away from when I'm taking freaking corners. I mean, at this point, if he's there, it, it will just get me, right? Does that mean it's just pointless going this way, then? Yeah, because I run through here, right? Why am I going this way? I don't need to. Yeah, back in here. And then choose another way to go. Which isn't that way either. I can check now in here. Anywhere near one? Oh, I just saw one up. It might have been that one. Oh. Oh, look, look where he freaking is, man. Oh, come on.
I did it! Hell yes! Three of them done! Never mind. Not three of them done. We have to do this first. Why? Oh, hello? How are we doing? How are we doing, mate? Is this your true form? How am I doing this, by the way? And now what? I've done three of the game modes. Insane. Won't you play? I've got all of the three stars that have miniature stars under them. I need star four and five. No, I'm not playing that version again. I, I want to say that actually wasn't fun. That was still fun, but it was the least fun out of all of them. Well, the hardest out of all of them, should I say. Now we go into star number four. Um, li living halls, yes. So the original plan was to there be... So the original plan was for there to be two videos on It Stills. The first one being the first five or the five main game modes. And then the second video being now I know there's three separate, or at least I think there's three separate things, you know, with the stars, with the little stars under them. I've only clicked on the first star, so for all I know, that could be the only thing. I imagine because there's three miniature stars, that means there's three extra game modes and plus there's three achievements left or four. At the time of me doing this, I've got every bonus achievement bar the one that you have to complete the phantom with the in-game volume set to zero so for right now doing this voiceover i have i guess i think there's 11 achievements so i guess i've got seven of 11 there's three being the star things that we'll be doing in episode number three i guess and then episode number two now would be the last two the living halls and the phantom plus all of the bonus achievements and then episode three would be the three achievements to complete the last three game modes hopefully that makes sense enjoy episode number one which i guess is finished now so hopefully you did enjoy episode number one and thanks for watching and i will see you in episode number two